Welcome to Medical Insight, a weekly healthcare feature brought to you by the experts at Essentia Health. Here's your host, Anthony Matt. Today on Medical Insight, we're showing you how we use state-of-the-art technology to perform minimally invasive thoracic surgeries. Here's how the Da Vinci robot works and how it benefits patients. Essentia Health is now using the Da Vinci robot to perform minimally invasive lung and chest surgeries. Lung cancer is one of the conditions that are treated on the robot, but also lung nodules, mediastinal tumors, esophageal conditions, and also benign conditions like COPD. The Da Vinci operates as an extension of a surgeon's eyes and hands. Using a laser system, the robot configures itself precisely, ensuring optimal surgery positions based on a patient's needs. One of the benefits we're seeing from the robot is uh, a lot less pain because we're having smaller incisions. A smaller incision results in patients being in the hospital uh, less amount of time and getting home uh, quicker and back to work uh, a lot quicker than if they were to have a traditional type of operation. The surgeon operates the robot with fine-tuned mechanics through an overhead console that allows for up-close access to every step of the procedure. One of the newest things I'm excited about is the ability to uh, use a special green dye to mark lung nodules that we typically couldn't even see or feel if we were doing any traditional uh, type of lung cancer operation. Um, it allows us to uh, uh, identify and resect um, taking less of the lung and able to treat the earliest uh, stage lung cancers um, for better outcomes. Perhaps one of the biggest advantages is being able to perform complex operations within the chest cavity that previously would have required a large incision and spreading of the ribs. The Da Vinci is used in several other types of surgeries including abdominal, colorectal, gynecological, and more. This medical insight was brought to you by Essentia Health. To learn more, go to EssentiaHealth.org.